Raina's room. I'm Koichi. I'm a normal office worker living a very honored life, but. Huh? What are you looking at me for? Is something on my face? No, just admiring your beauty as always. Yeah, I love it. But thanks. I'm the happiest guy in the world because Raina is mine. Koichi, can we drop by the supermarket? You haven't looked well recently, so I'll make a lot of nutrition food for you. Sure, we can. Thank you for that. I feel the happiest when you are nice and well. Alrighty. I work even harder to become a great provider for my Reina. Reina always cares for my health and makes healthy lunches for me while I'm so busy with work. She's very dedicated. And she will be my wife very soon. <laughs> don't push yourself too much. We have a spare time. Why don't we go to a cafe before shopping? Sounds great. I'm thirsty. Oh, I've wanted to come to this cafe. Good timing then. I'm gonna have some sweets. Oh, I like the atmosphere. The cappuccino is very nice. <laughs> Here you go. This is Cafe Mocha. Wow, looks nice. Let's taste it. How is it? Can we start to have a taste? Huh? Koichi? What's wrong? Ah! Koichi? Are you okay? Hey! Koichi! That happened. My boyfriend suddenly claps. Don't move him. I'm a doctor. I'd call an ambulance and take him to my hospital. Oh, okay. Please take good care of him. I will. Leave it to me now. Oh, 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 oh where am I? Uh, I can't move. What I just choose? You're awake. Uh, uh, who are you? And how did you know I woke up straight away? I'm your doctor. You passed at a cafe and you were taken to this hospital. Do you remember that? Oh yes, bakery. Your memory is not so clear, I guess. Well, you have been asleep for a week, so no wonder. Don't worry, you will be all better soon. Had I sleep for a week? What happened to my work then? <laughs> I had a very important presentation to attend! You're silly. Which is more important, your health or your work? Well, the part of your is. My work! Uh, the part of me is what? Is there something wrong with me? No, not too worried. You don't have to worry about your work. Your colleagues visit you and I explain it to them. Oh! And I'll let your family know as well. Oh, that's okay then. But I bet Raina's being worried. She cares about my health a lot. Uh, who's Raina? She's my girlfriend. We're getting married soon. Can I call her now? Huh? If that's so, I don't recommend calling her that if we want to. Huh? Why don't you? She's never visited you. I saw everyone who visited you, but she wasn't one of them. That can be too. Oh, I'm getting back my memory. That's right. I was with her when I passed out. If you don't blame me, you can check the visitor sign in list. See? Oh, you're right. She must be feeling responsible that I collapsed and blaming herself. I have to go back to see her as soon as possible. Doctor, let me get over here. What are you thinking? I can't do that. But it was just from overworking, wasn't it? I'm awake now, feeling fine. <sighs> are you ready to accept the truth? The truth? What do you mean? Are you ready to know what you got? Is it something bad? What on earth is it? You've got a cancer. It's quite critical. What? That's impossible. You should examine my body again. I'm awake and totally fine now. It's common to be in denial at first. You can take time to accept where you stand little by little. No, but I'm getting married very soon. This is my prime time and I've got cancer. What did I do to get that? You've done nothing wrong and you don't have to overwork anymore. For a few days, I was at the lowest point. It would have been better if I could see Reina. 
My family pissed at me, but Reyna never showed up. I want to see Reyna. For the sake of the participant's recovery, he is not allowed to have visitors but his family. I'm his girlfriend, and I know his colleague saw him the other day. Please, let me see him in for short time. His conditions been changing day by day. I understand how you feel, but it is the participant that is struggling the most at the moment. But, right, we will have medical consolation to find out more about your condition. Lay down here and close your eyes. Okay. Take a deep breath. Bless her in and out. Oh, I started feeling right headed. You are doing well. Firstly, what is your favorite color? Green. Good. That's the color of healing. You must have been exhausted. Is there anywhere hurting right now? No, I don't feel any pain. That's great. Are you worried about your work? Of course I am. But more than work, I'm... Oh, forget it. Oh boy, sounds so good. Makes me zone out. Feel free to say it. You can tell me anything. Reyna, well, my girlfriend Reyna. I'm thinking about her, but I can form sentences as well. Reyna is a stalker. Reyna is a stalker. No, she's my girlfriend. I'm getting confused. No, she isn't. Reyna is a stalker. Reyna is a stalker. That's right. I'm your girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. But Reyna is my fiancé. Huh? Who is what? Nothing to worry about. Your fiancé is me. My fiancé is you. That's right. I love you. But Reyna has been cooked with only food for me. Reyna is a stalker. Reyna forced you to eat her food to make you get a cancer. She forced me. Reyna's food made me get a cancer? That's right! But I'd cure you! That's what I'm here for! I won't be better soon! That's the spirit! To get a better, stay away from anyone but your family and be your house husband freak reparation at my farm! I can do that! My beloved fiancé is waiting for me at home! Huh? You hear my fiancé? What about Reyna? Reyna is a stalker. I'm your fiance. You are gonna live together forever. Okay, I'll get married to you then. Good boy. If we become house husband and stay at home. I will stay home. I'll become a house husband. Uh, uh? Wasn't I made of the consultation? No, I can't remember a thing. You are not a lotus! Stop! I'm sorry, but I have to see Kawichi! Oh, you are a stalker! I've got cancer because of you! Kawichi? What are you talking about? It's me, Reina, your fiance! What? That's enough nonsense! Doctor, get rid of her right now! I will. I'll make sure that she won't come near you ever again. Why? What happened? Let me talk to him, please. It was scary. You are safe now. I totally bonded her entry. Thank you, doctor. I preparated everything for this moment. I became a doctor and had been waiting for a chance to implement my plan. <laughs> Oh, it feels so good. <laughs> I hear someone laughing. A goddess? This was the beginning. The girl in front of me wasn't a goddess. It was the most beautiful girl in my school, Eve. And I'm headed to capture her right now. You can't run away now. What? We'll be together from now on. Why are you doing this? <laughs> You've got to let me go! Otherwise... What? Is this... getting through to her? Let me go, otherwise! There is no problem. 
Your parents have been away for a trip since yesterday, haven't they? How? How does you know that? I know everything about you, Koichi. Right, Dad. I was suddenly forced to be with her every second. My name is Koichi. I'm an honor high school, but it has been harassing me all the time. She must write teasing nerds. This must be a joke or more of harassment. Why are you planning to take this off? In a week! What? Until then, we're like this in the shower and bed. <gasps> You're blessing so cute! Huh? Who gets that? How did you get in my house? It's not hard. Not hard? I guess it was good that today is Saturday. Right, let's have a morning bath. Really? I didn't see her. I was covering my eyes. But... Oh, that was refreshing. Her skin will touch mine. Oh, when I think about it... Koichi? Oh, I'm okay. I am fine. Were you too excited because we just had a bath together? No, I... She looks cute, but... <laughs> she must be saying that to enjoy my reaction. Since then, we've done everything together, including going to the toilet. And now, I'm in bed with Eve next to me. It's nice and warm, isn't it? Yeah. Are you pretending it's nothing? So cute! I want to sleep on the floor, but if I get down, I pull her arm. Oh. Oh. <sighs> she looks so cute. I couldn't sleep at all that night. I'm so sleepy. You look so tired. That's because you were next to me. You're good. What? You're very skillful. I practiced because I want to be a cute wife someday. That cuteness is not fair. And then, the tricky time has come. Shit, it's already Monday. I was so nervous to see their reactions, but... Why? Why don't they say anything about it? Of course, they won't say anything. I knew all of their weaknesses. They won't dare. Don't they think this is weird? Maybe everyone isn't interested in others as much as we think. You think so? But if it's the most beautiful girl, it's all that no one's interested in her. Oh, look! The seats are available for us! Huh? But ours just one next to each other. But those are the only ones that are available, so please! It's too obvious that it's set up. <laughs> I'm impressed by everyone. They had seats ready for us. Right, Dad. No one mentioned a thing about our handicaps. We spend days with handicaps at school as well. And it was Friday. Tomorrow will be the last day to be handicapped to Eve. I love you! She's been using a new teasing method since Monday. She's been telling me that she loves me. Now she can get much reaction from me with handcuffs, so she must have needed something new. I've been showing my affection this much. Why doesn't he respond to it at all? <laughs> oh, he's still at this school. I thought he quite since he wasn't around at all. Crap! I'm sure he wouldn't leave me alone. How annoying! Hey, Hib! Oh, stop talking to me! Your face is cute as always. Uh, huh? What the hell is this? <laughs> uh, he heard me attend school, so I couldn't find his weakness. I knew he would disturb us. What's going on? How penalty? Oh, are you guys daddy now? I know, you're stalking her. Aren't you Mr. Nude? No, I'm not. <laughs> what is it about it? This is hilarious. You mean to be together with handcuffs? We are nothing like that. I've had enough of this. What? Hey, don't work up like that. I'm done off. <gasps> what? Is he crying? 
Have you had enough of me? Huh? Why is he? I just wanted you to look at me. This is not a joke. Does he serious like me? I'm sorry to bother you that much. I really am. Oh, uh, me too. What are you? I have to tell her. Hey, where are you? Just come with me. Yutaro! Huh? There is something I want to tell you. What? What I said wasn't true. Huh? We earned nothing. <laughs> That's obvious by the work of you too. What? We're dating. <laughs> Thank you for showing it off. Koichi? To tell you the truth, I've been having fun the whole week. I'd love to be with you more. Are you serious? I am. You didn't act like you were interested in me at all. That's because I never expected that you were interested in me. I thought this was all a joke. No, it wasn't. So after we take off the handcuffs, will you still be with me? <laughs> of course, I will. Thank you. I will keep the handcuffs, perhaps. Thank you for watching till the end. I will be grateful if you could subscribe and comment.